Alright, so I don't know if you can hear me because this mic is pretty bad, but the first step, if this camera would stop moving, is to press the recording button. So I'm recording on the camera already. I usually do that last, but because I have to record this, I'm doing it first. Press record on a garage band to record my audio. I have the mic set up here, also the app or the uh, Elgato here. Make sure you're charging if you're on a laptop. Um, then you go to the Elgato scar uh, screen capture card um, that you get when you just set up your Elgato, and you just have to press the capture button down here. So now this is recording my gameplay. This is recording my audio. And this will record my face. Alright, now for lighting, I'm still not that great at lighting, but you put the light behind the camera instead of behind you, like I used to do in my earlier videos, which would just blind my viewers. Don't know why I did that, um, but I just thought that would be the best way to go about it, and it wasn't. Now with newer cameras, you have the little flip-out screen on the side so you can see what you're filming. I don't have that, unfortunately, so I kind of just have to guess. That's why I'm not always like in the exact middle of the video, because I can't see it. So I'm recording this right now, I'm just gonna try to sync everything up, so I usually do that by clapping, and then I'll say right, 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 left, 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 so then I can sync the audio, which goes underneath the actual recording of the gameplay. Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Silver to Glory. Six and a half hours later. This is usually where I stop to take a moment to just like, you know, reflect and cry because I know Ia hates me. That's where I'm going to leave it off for this episode of Silver to Glory. Hope you enjoyed FIFA 16. And as always, don't forget to spare pets. Okay, so that's pretty much um, the recording done. Now I just have to render all this, which isn't really too difficult. There's just like a share button here that I press, and then I have to open the file. I have to download the file, download the MP4 or whatever it's called. Uh, the movie file onto my hard drive and then I'll show you what I do in iMovie. Alright, so now I just make a project in iMovie. So iMovie's free if you didn't know, which is pretty good because I don't like spending money. So then you go to the movie section and there should be what you rendered from your Elgato. Then you just drag it down to the main part and it should function pretty well. And then you can grab what you downloaded, what you made in GarageBand, which is just your audio, and that goes underneath and then you go to your photos library and you should get your video. So I just detach the audio from the uh, gameplay because I don't really want the crowd noise. I had my own background music anyway. So I'm gonna get rid of that. And now comes the part which is the most annoying where you just have to figure out the uh, timing of everything. So I look for that part where I went one, two, three, clap. That probably just messed it up again. But I look for that, and then I try to sync it up based off that. Also, what I have to do is I usually do auto for the volume, and I just try to change. I, I don't really need to do reduce background noise because I didn't have the fan on. I recorded this pretty early, so it wasn't too hot. So I found where I started to talk, which is around here. So it's also it's a little bit more difficult because I was recording other stuff. But here's where I say right, 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 left, left, left. So I had to find that. So it starts like around here, I think. A little bit too early. So now that is synced up, but then you have to go find the um, video clip, which is up here. So it's around here. And usually I'll just press that to try to fix it a little bit, try to straighten up the cropping. And you can't put it directly on top because for some reason light, light travels faster than sound, so you have to keep that in mind. So the, uh, I forget, I think the image has to be a little bit faster. So now it looks like it's synced. And so that's really the most important part that I have to show you. Then I just go about editing, so I just delete the clips, delete the space inside, and then add anything that comes to my brain. Um, then once you're done, you just go to File, Share, then you upload it to YouTube. So if you guys have an Elgato, a PS4, computer, um, a TV, a microphone, if it's a Mac, I think you can do the same thing with Windows Movie Maker, and they probably have something equivalent to GarageBand to record your voice. You guys can do it too. Hope you like this quick video. Stay frosty. Okay, a pretty important part that I forgot to add is you have to click on this and then go to this button over here and select Picture in Picture. Otherwise, if it's cut away, it's just going to show this. So when you do Picture in Picture, it gives you this little box so you can put it in the corner. 
that gives you the face cam and the gameplay at the same time. Um, and I suggest doing this before you do anything else because uh, at least on this, on iMovie, I don't know how to position it in the same spot every time. So if you just do it for the entire clip and then when you want to cut away to only your face, then you can just go back to cut away. Otherwise, you're going to have to keep moving this around every time and it's kind of annoying.